Dion, about as tough a debut as you could have hoped for tonight. Personally, how did you feel you played? I thought I'd done well, uh, especially as it was my first game. Um, for the team, the main thing was the team that we done well. Uh, I think we deserve three points, but a point from, away from home isn't bad. We we'll take that. So, yeah. It was your first game for a while. You yeah. seemed to get stronger in the in the second half as the game went on. How, how's your fitness? Yeah, my fitness was good. My legs kind of uh, was going it towards the end, but I expect that to be fair. I haven't had a game in probably about five weeks. Um, but as I said, I think the team just gained momentum and that kind of spurred everyone on. Um, so I think it was a good push from the lads towards the end. We should have nicked the three points. So. And it's the hurly burly of the National League. I'm sure it's quite different to the Chelsea development squad. What's your first impressions of of the National League? Uh, this isn't my first impression. To be fair, I've watched my brothers for years playing this level, so I kind of know what to expect. Um, and I think that was kind of a, a good thing watching my brothers because it's kind of I've had my eyes open to what I needed to do. Um, so yeah, no, I knew what was coming. You arrived as a centre back, but you seem to fit into central midfield. That is your secondary position but you seem to fit into that defensive midfield position like yeah I've, I've since I was young I've played as I said earlier I've been my first and I said I've played everywhere um, but it's the team done well I think out from the back we play good football um, and yeah it was just good it was good playing with the guys everyone was communicating we all we all stuck together like I said one a point away from home here wasn't bad so yeah and it, it was always going to be coming to Boreham Wood going to be a, a, a tough physical game. Yeah. The team stood up really well and, and rose to that challenge. Yeah, I think the second part of the first half, we kind of lost our way a little bit. We didn't win our, our own individual battles, but then in the second half, the gaffer got into us a little bit. And second half, we, we dominated and we started winning our own battles and then the football came out on top. So, yeah, good effort from the lads in the second half. <clears throat> I think you've already answered this question. Happy with the point or do you think it should have been more? I think we are happy with a point, but as I said, I think three points was there to be taken towards the end. Um, but yeah, I don't think anyone's disappointed. It was a good good performance from the lads, and now we push on the Saturday at three points in. And it was vital to score, really good to score so quickly, having gone behind. To, yeah, definitely. Know, the second half performance was a lot yeah. better, but then having gone behind to equalise so quickly was, was vital. Yeah, it, it could have killed our momentum. I think we started in the second half really well, and it was just a kind of a sloppy goal, to be fair. Um, but it, the boys kind of, we, we just we stood up and uh, we gained even more momentum, got the goal straight away, which was def definitely a big thing um, and could have got a second or a third easily. And that's now five games unbeaten. Mm -hmm. the, the mood in the dressing room must be, must be pretty good. The, the yeah, everyone's got high spirits, everyone's on high spirits, so the confidence is there. I think we just need to kind of, last couple of games, we just kind of need to get that winning goal, I think, and kill teams off. Um, but as I said, I think. I think we need to move on to Saturday and, and get the three points then. You've been here a while, you've travelled with the squad to Dover, you've been on the bench in the last couple of games. How, how have you settled in? Are you, are you enjoying your spell? Yeah, brilliant. Your the spell? Gap has woke me in really well. The boys, they're a good bunch of lads, um, so I can't complain. Yeah, I'm loving it down here, to be fair. Brilliant. Well, long may yeah. it continue. Thank you very much. Thank you.